Tapobon. The night is giving way to dawn. The sky is a riot of color. Sunlight creeps into the trees that are full of colorful flowers. A little further is a tiny hovel, and farther than that is a river. A little girl called Kiranmala enters with a bright smile and a basket in which she starts collecting flowers. Kiranmala is almost startled by the beautiful chirp of a bird. A bird, invisible and therefore mysterious. She engages in flower picking again, only to stop to hear the bird singing its sweet twitter. Where are you, my little loving sweet? I know, you're hiding only to make me hear you tweet. I am here, a little fellow, hidden amidst the leaves so green, people call you Kirin Mala. That's what I have seen. Little Robin, Little Robin, where are you singing? Looking at me from your place of hiding? I will not say, never give myself away, not until Arun and Barun come. That's something about which I am firm. Here I am, my brother Arun. Here I am. My brother Borun. What's the matter, my little sis? This morning, what is it that you miss? Among those green leaves is hidden a little red robin. But it won't show itself to me. That makes me feel so lonely, you see. Where could it have gone? Where are you, bird? You tiny one? Here I am, you silly little boys. See how I trick you, as if I'm fooling with toys. And you won't find me in rain or shine or dew. Red Robin, Red Robin, why are you hiding? What's up? What's poppin'? We love to watch you dancing. Little bird, you are so sweet. We will tie maracas around your neck. We love to hear you tweet and watch you dance to the forest to deck. We will make you an anklet and a toe ring that will glow with a silvery light. We want to say you sing and bring us a flood of delight. Would love to do what you ask, but I have a request to make, which if you keep, will I bask, or else I would think our friendship is fake. Sure, your request we will grant, but first we have to know what is it that you want, and from there we will go. Will you dance for me forever, like the bees among the flowers? That should be fun! And that's easy fun! We'll spread the joy of life with dance and mirth. And if you join us with your fife, we will know no dirt! Yes, I am singing! And see, we are dancing! Amidst the leaves and flowers, so green, red and pink, the sun comes in showers, the forest with a light, never to sing, and tree little kids sing, bringing Thank you.
wish one and only one. Love to see you dance. It brought life to the forest. But if you for one, promise me to be honest. We're sure come before you and make you happy too. Little bird, we're playful. This morning, you're quite a handful. All right, this is the last. After that, please act fast. Or else, I will know that our friendship was just a show. Listen to my words, and please don't get upset. I have found in this nest a mother's love and home. But who is your dad? And who is your mom? Who is your own? And where is your home? If you answer me before your eyes, shall I come? Little Red Robin, did you ask who is our father? Yes. And who is our mother? Yes, yes. We don't know. The hermit is our teacher and parent. That's all we know. That hollow there is not your home, and the hermit isn't your own. You two are like lost flowers that have come to the green forest, thrown into the unknown. All you taught and all you did are wrong, even if you think them splendid. Tell me, who is your dad? And who is your mom? If you do, out of the crease, you will see me come. Arun Barun Kirana. So innocent. You make the morning sun awake and all darkness faint. Why aren't you happy? What is it that made you so pale, as if you could never be jolly? Kiranmala, I see pearls in your eyes. You are not meant for tears or sighs. Ma'am, who is our mother? Your dad? Your home? I wonder too. I don't know anything. Not even some. Meaning? Want to know? Listen. This was the river where one morning I was taking my bath, and I saw this clay pot floating on the river. What did I see? I saw an infant in that pot. He looked like a child of the gods. I held him and named him Alu. One year had passed. Once again, I was bathing in the river where I found a clay pot. I found this beautiful baby inside the pot whose eyes had the spark of divinity in them. I held him and named him Bolo. Another year had passed. I was bathing in the river and found a toy boat floating. The boat was small and in it was a tiny, pretty, baby girl. I picked her up and named her Kirama. And realized 
that someday you will come to know that I am not your kin. I resolved that when that day comes, I shall leave, never to return. The day has come. I shall leave. you go. Without you, our lives are empty. We don't have anyone else to call our own. Who said you are alone? You have everyone. The forest, the hovel, the birds, the animals, all are yours. I am a hermit. Once I've made up my mind to do something, I will have to do it. <laughs> Be happy. Be happy. to chime with clouds from high. I am not scared of clouds or storms, for they are mere toys. I defy fear in all its norms. It's the inner spirit that fear destroys. Then you should go to that hovel that's surrounded by shade. You will find many deer sit in marble to the sweet children nature has made. Change my fate. What can I do to thank your kindness? We don't want anything back. Any good. Like the forest, we are here to serve and make no men. Who has taught you such greatness? Where are your parents who know no end to kindness? What happened? Looks like you're scared. Why the sun change? You look pale with despair. We have no mom. We have no dad. We have no one of our own. That hovel in the forest is all what we have ever had. And that is our home, no matter how poor and warm. No mother's love? No father's care? Come well with me. All your joys and sorrows will you share with me? 
and then happy you will be. Oh dear king, how can we go? Can we leave the birds and flowers that makes this forest glow? This forest is where we belong. We love its joyous light and song. Would you then at least promise to ask me for help if you ever need anything? You agree, dear king, to the old and the poor, so much love you bring. But all we can do is look at one and another, unable to say where we come from and where do we go. Kira Mala, my little sis, I have a feeling that though they very well who knows who our parents are, could only mysteriously sing and not tell us the story of our life's rose. So the little mischievous robin knows? Let me ask the bird. My dear little sister, can you please tell me who are our father and mother? But how would I know? If you know, please tell us so. I really don't know. I'm being honest. I ask you just like that, out of curiosity at best. Then, I can tell you about Someone who can help you, but you have to make it to that place. Could you? Yes, we can. We can. Can you? Yes. Then listen to me. Several miles from here, you will find a hollow where an old woman lives. She's singing herself. Go to that hall, but make sure you don't show yourself before the old woman when she is singing. Because if you do, Oz will spit out fire, only to reduce you to ashes. What shall we do, little Robin? Don't worry, I will tell you what to do. Do you have an idea what to do? What do we have to do? You will have to secretly tie a flower onto the old woman's gray hair. Flower? Why? The flower will prevent fire coming out of her eyes. No fire? Then? The old woman will be very happy to see the flower. She will like you for it and answer all your questions. Really? You will know what you are there. Little Robin, you are a darling. You are a darling true. In your tiny heart is glowing all kinds of gems. Green, red, and blue. Stomach on the heat 
too clumsy to move or even sit. If to the frog one cake I bequeath, the frog shall turn into an elephant sweet. Warm. We have Arum, Barum, Kiranmala, three siblings. We have come from a land far. We have no one of our own to share our feelings. I see. This is a red, red rose. How did this land in my head? Hope I'm not in a daze. Oh, woman, dear, we have got this rosy flower to adorn your hair. You are a lovely little kid. Why is there such a gloom hovering on your foreheads? Oh, dear old lady, we're terribly sad. We don't know who our mom is or who is our dad. Please tell us where they are. How will I know? Do I have the wand to tell me so? My little sis is crying all day and all night. Why don't you tell us where our parents are hiding? If you do, it will be our greatest delight. I am so sad to see you three. Don't be scared. For all now, make your sorrow flee. All right, all right. We'll see what I can do. We'll have to make a happy you. Where are you, my little mischief magic? Come and heal the havoc and the tragic. See that palace? You will have to go there. How will we go there? First, left, then right, then to the back, and then to the front. A beautiful bird there will tell you everything and go right away to find out what you want. Listen, listen. There is a witch there. Don't go in front of her. There is a girl who is more beautiful than ever. Don't ever look at her. If you do, the monsters will watch you and gobble you down. Off you go now. Shoot! One more thing. Let me tell you. Keep this flower with you. Then, no one can harm you. Now, off you go. Run, run. No one shall harm you. Not anyone.
Won't I know? Oh, Bird of Wonderland, why are my brothers sleeping so? Nothing to worry. The witch has put them to sleep. How will they wake up from such a deep sleep? Do you see water pop along the street? Yes. Take it. Sprinkle the water from the pot on around and around.
matter? How will I eat? Why can't you eat? These are all yummy deserts. Whose voice is this? Here I am. Just look behind you. How can a bird talk? Per magic. Magic? How will you eat food that is made of gold, pearls, and gems? If this food can be eaten, how can a human being give birth to kittens or puppies or wooden dogs? What do you mean? Didn't mean anything. But you know, it is very surprising that being a king, you were so naive that you believed what others said and made such mistakes. Mistakes? No, I could never commit mistakes. Yes, you did. You should know that Arun Burn and Karen Mother are your children. My children? Yes, your children. Do you remember the sister of your queen? Yes, yes. Do you remember the year when your queen gave birth to a child and the palace was celebrating? But the queen's sister told you that the queen gave birth to a puppy. Yes, I remember. The next year again, when the palace was overjoyed, the queen gave birth again. And then another sister of the queen told you that the queen gave birth to a kitten. Really? The year after the queen gave birth again, but one of the queen's sisters informed you that the queen gave birth to a wooden dog. Actually, the queen had given birth to two sons, Arun and Barun. And in the third year, to a daughter called Karima. The queen's sisters were jealous, and so they played these tricks on you. What are you saying, you bird? children in either play pots or toy boats and left them to float on the river. And you punish your queen by banishing her. Oh, I do not believe this. I'm being honest. Okay. You are my children. Daddy! Where is my bereaved queen? Wish she were here. You see that little river flowing? And beside it, a tiny hut? That's our dear mother's dwelling. Whoever knew that? Is that true? What a blunder have I made. That's all of us. Me and you bring the queen in a gorgeous carriage from which gold will never fade.
Wow. Again, a big applause for the kids. When I was a kid, I read the actual story in Bengali, but this just revived me the cure. Thank you for that. So let me just introduce you to the all actors. In Kiran Mala, Oishani Aturthi. Harni, Atrei Aturthi. Red Robin, Tiara Mukherjee. Golden Bird, Annie Banerjee. Garn, Kritika Mari, Ball, Ruhan Para, King, Savi Para, Old Lady, Roshni Pillai, Varun, Rohil Paranjari, Queen, Mahi Gupta, and Arun, Abhiraj Rai. Thank you very much again, Harbit, herself.